All right, let's do a quick view to our how our cities are doing. Uh, this is a quick view for all our cities. So we can see some kind of total production that we have, what we're building in each one. So it's more easy to manage, especially if you have uh, a big group, uh, a huge group of uh, cities. Um, so we, yeah, we were able to take Rome. And, uh, of course, you guys missed that part, but uh, it was a very boring fight, so it wasn't even worth it to keep in a video. So we take care of Rome, and uh, so got some modern infantry already, and right now we're moving forward and trying to get rid of the Sulu, because remember, the German is getting too close to the culture victory, so in order to get there, I need to get rid of the, the Sulu, so I can put my troops in a, in a couple of chips and take care of the German but uh, we had a very decent production of vehicles tanks uh, I, I built some roads between the cities so I should be able to move more faster so I'm connecting all the cities from from there to Rome um, yeah usually the I, I can it's very simple the, the, the Roman get um, in very bad shape and uh, since we took control of the his fur expansion so, right now it was, it was just a matter of time to get rid of him. And yeah, we're gonna keep pumping tanks for now. And communist is just around the corner, so we should be able to start producing, like math, um, all the troops. Okay. Factories I'm in control, so I need to build factories, get those. Con uh, construct uh, some buildings and wonders a little bit faster um, I'm trying to do something because very, very honestly the, the German is, is very close to to finish the game okay so the cruisers should be in this island yep still thinking that no matter what I gotta get rid of that soon um, the probably he keep pumping and pumping riflemen and the German is only three great people away to start building the United Nation um, and we're still running behind everybody of course that's 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 normal don't don't panic it's just matter to strike one strike hard and right now we're doing that with a couple of armies of tanks tanks army and also some naval support we have a, a fleet of cruise, cruisers in there giving some some interesting bonuses um, of course you gotta keep uh, defense in every every single city don't take any risk um, but this city should be able to go down in any minute I don't think those riflemen can really hold for much longer all my attacks with tanks but um you see, I have a, at least like a four or five tanks armies in there, pushing hard and trying to get control of them. Uh, actually, the, my one, what I'm planning to do right now is just get rid of this city and uh, the other one that I've been attacking from the from the hill, and then probably the Sulu capital because the Sulu is the kind of uh, enemy who's gonna keep attacking you no matter what so as soon as we get rid of the capital probably the guy's gonna uh, be a little more quiet and less annoying so yeah we're gonna now i'm gonna push hard and get rid of this uh, city right here uh, so you guys can notice that um the the whole idea of playing with the indian is just control those special resources uh, and use them of course make sure that you're getting the right ones uh, you are probably gonna take a couple extra risk finding a good location with your starting oh I didn't mention that I shouldn't say anything okay we, we're gonna build the Manhattan project in the background just in case we need in a hurry but um, in the meantime uh, so I was saying that 
it's very important to sacrifice a little bit at the beginning to make sure you have some interesting resources uh, close to to your first city, your capital, so you can start building a, a strong game. Uh, so far, everything we got under control. We got some a couple modern infantry armies, and we need some, yeah, some culture. I don't know. I, I, I didn't do anything about the the culture in this game. Um, just focuses the the domination part right now. We got Rome already. That's one of the capitals and. Zimbabwe will be next if everything goes according to what we have planned and hopefully we're gonna have enough time to go and get rid of the German first too late but so far we're moving fine we're moving in, in like a blitzkit uh, strategy which is a classic German strategy uh, moving forward in one line and destroying whatever is in your path um, so far it's been working uh, with those tanks and now we're getting closer and closer to 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 take our second capital if it's possible of course and uh, just remember never left your tanks behind without uh, an infantry uh, to protect them I know that's not the case but uh, it's important because the tanks are very good attacking, but in defense are horrible. So even if you have an army of tanks, if they attack you with one tank, they have a chance to <laughs> put you down. So that's that's not even funny. So let's start building some stuff. This city is growing uh the speed of light. Seventeen. Wow, okay. Um yeah, I'm gonna probably start moving a couple, getting some some defense. Um that might give us a I help so we can, in the from other cities we can start or keep pumping some tanks. Uh, okay, so that's exactly what I was saying. That the the, the attacking tank always have the the edge. So be careful when you leave your your vehicles alone. Always keep a rifleman or infantry with them. So the German wants to take my. Atomic theory that's not gonna happen buddy. That's actually my only that's my ace right now. Um hopefully if I see that they build in the United Nation, let's see if we can get the Manhattan project and uh, up and running. Um the good thing that we we now we have the with the the bonus with the courthouse, most of our cities are expanding very fast and and now we are Taking control, full control of that section. Um, yeah, bum. Oh, come on, okay. Let me see. Got some gold production. The culture is not that bad down in there because they have the temple. Uh, but still, remember, we got communists right now. Um, but that's not helping me. <laughs> well, probably build a wall, yeah. Slip. Let's keep the wall in there just in case. Uh, let's keep pushing the Sulu. No matter what, I need to get rid of this guy. It is amazing how many. In, in Daily, it, it really looks like the computer, the computer is cheating. Uh, in this case, the guy has been pumping Rifleman's army like crazy. And that at that rhythm is, is pretty much impossible. So. But uh, well, if you're playing a uh, lower difficulty, you, you're gonna notice that it's a lot more simple. And right now, it's like a, the guy looks like he have like a thousand armies in there because I've been killing one after another one, and there's still there's still somebody else in there waiting for me, no matter what. Look at that. Um, as long as the okay, that's not gonna happen. That's not good. Um, come on. All right. And now the, those riflemen are stronger than before. Uh, that's not gonna help. Anyway, um, let's keep getting some more infantry. Um, defending our cities because we get, we gotta we move forward, but we gotta make sure that they're in the we're defending those, not leaving behind. 
Okay, let's continue the next video, guys.